It looked like the, the sheriff helicopter was circling and it was really low and I thought it was going to crash. So I drove down there to see, the, you know, if a helicopter's going to crash and here comes all the police officers. And Not knowing what was happening, Marvin Blazingame shot this video showing the barrage of emergency crews that raced to Westwood around 11 this morning. Moments before, Blazingame says he heard the sound of gunfire. No sooner I got down here, Green Township, Cheviot, Colerain, Sheriff's Department, everybody's pulling up. A black Camry pulls up, a guy jumps out, starts running. The police are they're automatically on him. He's going nowhere. Dogs and everything, I start recording, one phone die, you hear a shot. Were you thinking and there was more than one uh, suspect or was it just the one? It looked like just one. And he took off on foot. Like I said, he wasn't going nowhere. They were, they were on him. But I definitely heard the shot. I heard the cops talking. He was down. But I don't know if he was dead or not. Tyler Prater also saw and heard some of the commotion. I heard two gunshots and I saw a lot of sirens. At the time, Prater was rehabbing the former Mother of Mercy school building on Work Road. Uh, my friend, he said, come here, come here, come here. And he saw the person run between those two houses right there. Both Prater and Blazingame say it was clear the suspect, now known to be Robert Schneider, had met his match. 30 seconds later, we saw 12 police cars right there. He made it that far, and that's where it looks like it ended. Now, when Schneider recovers, he faces a long list of charges uh, related both to today's robbery, chase, and shooting, as well as those other robberies in both Hyde Park and in Kentucky. Reporting live tonight in Westwood, Todd Dykes, WWT News 5.